People in Manhattan are preparing for our next chance of rain as the water at Tuttle Creek Lake rises, turning temporary solutions to protect themselves and their homes. KSN2 News reporter Mackenzie Davis is live in Manhattan. Mackenzie, what do we need to know tonight? Molly, the key word there, temporary. People are turning to sandbags and pumps to keep their home clear of water. The lake may see rising levels, which could cause flooding. People in Manhattan are sealing doors and windows as best they can as they sit and wait to see how much Tuttle Creek rises. I am a little nervous. Right now, the lake's pool level sits at 1,132 feet, 57 feet above normal, leaving people and businesses to turn to sandbags to keep water out. Not everything's a permanent solution. Water is going to get in one way or another. While it's temporary, employees at businesses like Sears in Manhattan are preparing early in case the lake floods. But we have uh, semis, a couple of trailers that are coming in and uh, got a group of guys that are going to be here. So if we have to rack everything up and put stuff on the trailers, I think we'll, we'll be able to get her done. Ace Hardware says sandbags aren't the only solution. Sealing will keep like a tight seal so nothing can leak through and then pumping out water is better in the long run till you can get something, somebody over to your house and fix it. Ace Hardware and Riley County Emergency Management say sandbags and pumps will keep water out of your home long enough to get your belongings. Live at Tuttle Creek, Mackenzie Davis, KSNT News. All right, thank you, Mackenzie.